Add and low vision tricks. Get going at yourtechvision.com. So I'm going to show you some low vision uh, features of the iPad. Let's go ahead and go into our settings. You go into general and you go into accessibility. Uh, if you use voiceover, you cannot use voiceover and zoom at the same time. You can use voiceover or large text and white on black at the same time though. So let's show you the zoom effect. And if I touch the screen with three fingers twice, it increases the zoom. And then I just take my three fingers and I drag it around and it increases the size nicely. Let's go ahead and go back home. Let's go to our notes so you can see the effect of your notes. Now one issue with the notes is if you have a keyboard and you want to type in a list, there's going to be your issue. But just touch your keyboard and go ahead and just type in the information that you want. So we're going to make a grocery list. And then you can go back and just double tap it and increase the size of it. Or you can use an external keyboard, which is much easier also. So let's go ahead and go back to our home. And while we have it zoomed, I want to show you a feature that if you want to move your icons around, so I have my four icons at the bottom. Let's say I want to move music out and I want to move FaceTime in there. So what I'm going to do, and you can touch this with any icon, you're just going to touch and hold the icons until they start to jiggle and you're going to move one out and you're just going to move another one in. And then of course you can move your icons all around. You need to sit on your home button to set your icons so they don't move anymore. Let's go ahead and go back into our settings. Let's try another feature. So now we're going to turn zoom off and we're going to go into large text. Let's go ahead and choose 56 text. Let's go ahead and go back home and we're going to go into our notes and as you can see the font is a lot larger. Uh, let's show you the effect with zoom and large text. Let's go back into our settings. Let's go back into zoom, turn zoom on, go back home, and you can take a look at notes now. So now you have the zoom effect and the large text, which makes it really incredibly easy to see. And then of course, if you have an external keyboard, it is uh, far easier to type information. So if I was going to type information here, then of course I can type type it out versus trying to get to the keyboard that is much too large to see. Um, but you've got the zoom and the text so of course you hit your return and then you type in the information that you want. Go back to large text by just hitting it with three times so that is a really nice effect. Let's go ahead and add one more effect with that. We're going to go down to settings and we're going to keep the zoom on and the other effects and let's go down to white on black drive over here and we're going to turn that on. So now you have zoom, you have large text, and you have white on black. So let's go back to your notes so you can see the effect on that. And it makes it incredibly visible to see. So those are some nice features to get you going uh, with your low vision. Go out and try